There's no stopping Jim Brown on an effort like this. To the 50, 10, 5, corner, touchdown, Nick Chubb! He's done it again! <laughs> Football. I'm trying to at least. Those are our new jerseys. Uh, throwback, throwback. 75. I, like, I like the play. Oh, yeah, the helmet's dope. A little stripe on it. The helmet's dope. Down. Your hand. Squeeze it. Whatever feels right. Hey, W. What's up, dude? What's up, man? You look good, man. You like him? Sweet. Pretty tight. <laughs> yeah, really exciting year ahead of us here with the with the 75th anniversary of this this great franchise and. We will have some throwback uniforms this year. I think it'll be a nice representation of our, of our history, and, and I think people will be excited about the Elf uniforms for 2021. I think every detail is cared for with that uniform, and that's something that, you know, is going to be special. I know to the legends that have played and wore these jerseys before us and, you know, and how we make a statement in them this year uh, and for years to come. Oh, this is so right. This so right. Go to got to be a go-to. All right. Good evening, everybody. Let's get started. It's what we're about. Let's get to work. Okay. January 17th, 2021. That was our last game. So the last game of the 2020 season ends on January 17th. Okay. So we show up 87 days after that game. We show up on April 19th and we start the off-season program. And we say we have to do what? We have to improve as a team, a unit, and as a player. We have to improve, number one goal. Second goal we talked about was teach and reteach our systems. Third thing we talked about was developing and strengthening relationships, all right? So those were our goals of the off-season program. That includes this mini camp, okay? So that's your 59 days, that ends on Thursday, June 17th, and then guess what? You got 87 days till September 12th. A bunch of those 87 days are gonna be time off we're away from each other. So the work doesn't stop, all right? It never rests. So over the course of this mini camp, how are we gonna improve as a team? How are we gonna improve as a player? How are we gonna improve as an offense, as a defense, as a special team? We're gonna work. It's as simple as that. I appreciate you guys. Looking forward to seeing everybody over here tomorrow morning. Have a great night. I think the reason why we want to do something special from a uniform standpoint this year for 75 years is the Browns are one of those iconic franchises in all of sports, not just the NFL. And I think we really wanted to give a nice nod to the past and to the players that have paved the way for the team that we have here today and going forward. We just thought it was appropriate to put something together that would honor the past and then represent the future. The jersey clearly represents the 1946 team. The last time the team wore these jerseys, they actually won the 1946 championship game. And as you can see, uh, the, the patch, very clean, simple, iconic patch that represents an anniversary, just straight up football. And I think the, the logo itself represents just football and who we are. From a helmet perspective, we felt like uh, we could give a nod to the teams of the 50s and some of the early 60s with the white stripe, the gray face mask, and the numbers on the side of the helmet. We kind of touched on the teams from the 40s and the founding teams, and then we kind of touched on some of the teams after that. And it was just a nice way to say thanks to everybody that's been part of this organization. We're obviously very excited about this season, and we're excited to have a full house at First Energy Stadium. We just want to thank our fans for coming back and being loud and supportive for us this year and representing this team in the right way.